we were I meant to shoot an intro this morning before we left the house and that was three and a half hours ago we are currently in Maricopa Taft Maricopa in the Central Valley up here about 300 miles south of San Francisco so Nico and I are on our way to Petaluma to hang out with and get some video at Tia Barani Cutlery and Mark Beg Knives. Hopefully Mark. I need to see Mark. I like Mark. Yeah. So, yeah, that's what the video is going to be. You're going to see some of it and, like, Nico's probably getting some footage of me fucking angry on the road because we're three and a half hours into this and people are stupid. Surprisingly, not that bad of traffic, though. There's no. one idiot every now and then, but not yeah, that bad. Th what sucks is we're on a two-lane we're on a two-lane section of the Five. True. And all it takes is one idiot to screw it up for everyone. Yes. One bad apple ruins the whole bunch. It is pretty out here, though. It's because there's alcohol around us. No, it's, <laughs> that's not alcohol yet. It's just grapes. Soon. Grapes have to go through that magical, magical process of fermentation. <laughs> so, yeah, that's it, guys. I just wanted to do that. So, um, the next step is we're probably going to do that live knife giveaway announcement from the car. So, all right, guys. If, you, uh, if you're wearing headphones, here comes the music. signal to talk to him. In all actuality, I should probably put my phone on Do Not Disturb, which yeah. is what I usually do when I'm filming, but I'm not the one filming. So, you're at uh, Nico's. You're in the Hobbit hands. You're in Hobbit hands at the moment. No more cows, though. No more That's cows, interesting. though. Uh, let's see if we see another fucking 18 trucks full of apples. You've had a so lot of you them. guys have ever driven the five up through There's the Central Valley? Five. If you've ever driven the five up through the Central Valley, you will know it is two lanes wide, it's straight as an arrow, and it is boring. Boring. It's like driving through the middle. Damn water grows food. Damn right. <laughs> There's a dam out here. They, they fought about the dam, and there's still a, there's a contention. They want to build a dam on a river up here somewhere, on some waterway, and people are fighting it, so they have signs that says, damn water cruise. Food. Damn right. Just because you guys couldn't see it. I saw the... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where I was going with it. We, we've been up since three, so... We've been up since three. We've been driving for five and a half or five hours. We left at, what, 3.30? Yeah. It's 8.22 in the morning right now. We have driven four hours and 50 minutes, actually. How is that possible? How have we driven four hours and 50 minutes? How have we driven five? Oh, eight. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I don't math. math. I don't maths well. <laughs> I'm like, we've been driving for like three hours. <laughs> 342 miles so far, and we still have a lot, a lot left to go. Because yeah. we have another three hours. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. It's a long drive, guys. Long drive. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I don't hear any complaints about the fact that we're BSing in the car. <laughs> because we're bored! We're bored! And we had to do something or I was going to wreck the car. Yes. <laughs> you know what would have been great? Like, can you see this? Like, if Nico had fallen asleep, oh, if Nico had fallen asleep and I pulled right up behind this, like, ah! 
<laughs> that would have been perfect. But unfortunately, he'd have been asleep, so there'd have been no way to film it safely. Yes. But that would have been great. I've waited I've waited for years after seeing the first video of somebody doing yeah. that. I've waited for years to actually see it. We finally get to see it. And yeah, man. And you're awake and I can't ruin it ruins the practical joke. Yeah. It just does. So many semis. Holy crap. So another yeah. apple truck. Yeah, another apple truck. Alright guys. Right. Yeah, there's there's right there. nothing going on up here. So we will uh, check back in with you if we see something interesting. Which I'm pretty sure we won't. No, it's no nowhere. Or when we get to San Francisco. Because we have to drive past San Francisco. <laughs> yeah. So maybe maybe we'll get to see the bridge. I okay. believe we have to drive right by the bridge if I remember correctly. Right. Yeah, cool. So maybe we'll get that. Apples! Apples, uh, apples, apples everywhere. <laughs> Alright guys. Y'all take it easy. So I know I shouldn't be doing this. But I'll have you guys know this is incredibly boring. I'm driving 60 miles an hour on a road because there's a guy ahead of us that just decides that he has to pass that truck. But his car won't do it very well. Or his truck won't do it. It's another truck. I just, just wait till all the cars get out of the way. It's not like you're going that much faster than that truck. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. You're in the left lane and people are passing you on the right. You're in the wrong lane! Yes. You were, like for a videographer, you were not good at this. Maps keeps popping up. Maps and it's keep popping in up. Yeah, horizontal. I know. We gotta go 580. We're actually getting off the five. We are finally getting off the five. This is the first time since we left San Diego that other than stopping a pee. Up here at Modesto, we get to get off the five onto the 580. I want you to understand how boring this drive has been. This is exciting. Like, this is exciting for us. We are. We can go to San Jose. We, we're getting a click, 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 click. It's telling me to go somewhere other than the five. So boring. And I have to get on the 580. I hope there's extra lanes on the 580 because I'm really tired of this two lane bullshit. Yeah. It's just, it's. it's, it's I'll bad. figure out a way to bleep that out. Maybe. I don't know. I can get away with one or two. It's can't awful. drop too many. Can't drop too many off f bombs. Yeah. But it, oh, it's off. We could go to Stockton. Six months. Do you want travel? to? No, I don't want to. Then why do you keep bringing up places we could do? Because it's closer than we're going. So we could just like turn the trip into a trip to Stockton. Or Modesto. Because we're already at Modesto. But why? Because I'm tired of driving. <laughs> <laughs> That's the whole reason. Alright guys. We'll, we'll probably film something we stopped to get... Oh, this is garbage too. It's two lanes of slow traffic. Instead of one really slow lane and one relatively quick lane. Now it's two lanes. Uh, garbage traffic. Oh, look at all that equipment over there. Dude, look at that big bright red barn. Like, that's... You can even see that on the video. Boring. Boring. Yeah. That's got to be a mining operation. Probably. This is where you get all your sand and stuff. Sand. Sand, gravel, and aggregate. It's probably a concrete. It's probably a concrete plant. Alright, I gotta see. I gotta see if I can make it. I gotta see if I can make it. Can I make it around this van? Because if I don't make it around this van soon, I'm going to pull him off the side of the road and beat him to death. You're the only one in your van! Take off your mask! single person in the van, he's wearing a mask. Yeah. I mean, I get it, but you're not going to catch Corona from yourself. From yourself. Yeah. Nico's been tested. I've been tested. He's not going to catch it from us. Not like I'm going to spit out the car window into his car. Alright, guys, that's it. I, I can't do it anymore. <laughs> can't do it anymore. Real life. Oh, you're, you're filming? Yeah. Okay. So we are just outside. I mean, we just... Take exit 13B on the right onto I-580 West towards Point Richmond. Okay, so we just drove through downtown <laughs> Oakland. And if you have ever Im had an image in your head of what uh, downtown Oakland will look like, you're probably right. It's, it's, 
It's sketchy looking. But it is pretty out here. I mean, you got the ocean on both sides. We're kind of on a causeway. You got water on both sides. It's not bad. We're getting off the, another 1.5 miles. We're getting off the 580. So this is going to be a little bit longer video because this is like all of our trip videos. There's So we'll probably have some video of Dust doing stuff in the car. That'll be the short video. And then I'll do another intro because we're going to go eat. I texted Mattia and he said that uh, he is in meetings uh, at 11. And so we're going to go eat lunch and then go meet Mattia at the shop. So that's what we got to do is when we get close, we got to figure out. Oh, look. Oh, look what? Just junk. Tent city. Urban squalor. It's kind of like, oh, hey. Fine. <laughs> Oakland could explain what I smelled earlier. <laughs> I was like, what's that smell? And Nika goes, Oakland. I'm like, okay, yeah, that, that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. I wonder what the, I want to know what the obstruction is. If it's a bunch of people protesting, I'm gonna fucking laugh my ass off. This is such a long drive. Yes, this is. Dude, we have driven 310 miles since we filled up. Ugh. Since we filled the car up, and we had driven a lot of miles before that. Yes. Where are we at right now? On the we are seven hours and 18 minutes into the drive. 511 miles. It's a long drive. Nico, this is our longest trip so far, I think. Yep. How far is it from your house to Vegas? Uh, 300 something? Yeah. 380? Ish. Ish. Yeah. I don't, I don't like driving this far. I wish, I wish we'd stayed home and played video games. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. We'll get some whiskey and play video games. Uh, all right, guys, so when we get ready to go eat lunch, uh, we'll pick this back up. I have to stay where I'm at. Traffic is stop and go because our exit is like right, right here. there. Like right, like, right. Like point, yeah, there. Like there. Like 580 right. to Point Richmond, right two lanes. And apparently one of them is closed. You guys missed the, you met, you guys missed the entire, well, I'm just going to say shit show of the traffic trying to get off the downtown loop. Uh, in Oakland, yeah, you missed that. That that was that, bad. was that was interesting. That that was awful. That was awful. It's pretty bad. Okay. All right. That's it, guys. We'll, we'll rejoin, adjourn this, adjourn. Yeah. We'll uh, we'll pick us up later. I'm filming. I'm filming. We're filming. We yeah. lied. We lied. It actually is kind of cool out here. We're actually on the causeway. Somehow we managed up on a toll road, though. We can't really see it the other side, but this side a little bit. guys uh, we obviously have made it to Mattia Barani and Mark Begg we actually have done all that we shot a bunch of video we figured like 26 26 minutes yeah. so you guys are just seeing the trip and I know I'm looking here as opposed to here I'm really tired uh, it's what time is it right now oh, uh, five, o'clock. five o'clock so we've got here we've been here for about five hours been just talking with them I mean and they're busy so they're working and stuff like that so we're kind of just hanging out. We're going to stay here in the shop tonight. 
Uh, Nico and I have not decided there may be another video. We may go to Sonoma Cutlery. Uh, they're close. But the flip side is we're really tired and the time frame of the drive worked out really well. I mean, it, it really worked out pretty well, yeah. didn't it? Uh, we made, we slid right through LA. We slid right through Oakland. I figure if we leave about the same time and head the opposite direction, we're going to catch that same window of time where we really didn't get stuck in any of the big metropolitan areas. And I, I know there's a glare off of that light. I'm sorry. So, and at this point, to tell you the truth, I'm exhausted and I truly, truly don't care. Um, so we've, yeah, we've got about 26 minutes of video, uh, here in the shop. Uh, and a lot, like I said, a lot of this was just a sanity thing. Nico and I just needed to get out and do something. Isn't that right, Nico? Yeah. It's mainly you. Mainly me. Insane. Mainly me. I was going insane. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, we came up. We got to see some handle stuff. We really didn't film much of the actual process because there really isn't much going on. I mean, they're, they're, they're working through their uh, the Kickstarter of the Bowie Chef, if you haven't seen it yet, if you haven't seen my video on it, it's a great, great knife. Oh, so good. So good. Uh, so they're they're finishing up getting all of those shipped out and working on getting them into Knife Center and all that stuff. So, Lots of but, shipping. huh? Lots of shipping. Lots of shipping. I mean, basically that's what they've been doing since we got here. So I have a couple of people named Jack and Sonia that were here that were doing some work stuff. Uh, but other than that, I mean, basically it's it's been a day like where they've been working on shipping. They actually just left to go to the post office with boxes and boxes of stuff because they need to get it out before it closed so hang on a second i'll turn this around and i'll give you a sneak peek of some of the stuff that we looked at and, and just kind of an idea of what you're going to see in the video and like i said it's it's basically just me and mark walking around a shop and talking but it, it was a lot of fun and you know it's like 26 minutes of stuff and like i said it, once again i'd like to remind everybody these are available soon the uh, prototypes i approved the prototypes yesterday so they're gonna start rolling off the line. But hang on a second, I'm gonna walk out here and we'll take a look around. So just a quick preview, there's like a kitchen area and everything here. And this is, this is the Bowie Chef, if you haven't ever seen one. I know you guys follow my channel, but they have various sizes, various configurations, some of those are prototypes. But what I don't want you guys to forget is that there are still US made custom kitchen knives done by Mattia Brownie Cutlery. And they're not all just the Bowie Chef and things like that. We talked about their process for their handles, which is unique. Um, their handles are done and basically it's like this. It's like jigsaw puzzle. So they put stuff together, it looks cool. They get it all glued and put together on a liner uh, and then get it composited and put on the, on the blade and they get it all cut out of the biscuit. And you, know, you can see over here, there's some unfinished stuff. But uh, Mark, Mark goes through all this stuff. You can see these are knives that are in progress different types of handles and things like that. So it's actually a really cool process. We will be staying here tonight in the shop. There may be some goofy B-roll stuff that winds up. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm a fuck with Nico while he's sleeping. Pretty sure. If he sleeps, he drank that goddamn night. Now I'm the one that's sleepy because he caffeinated here just recently and I have not caffeinated since lunchtime. So yeah, guys, we made it 500 and something miles and we're gonna turn around and drive 500 and something miles back tomorrow. So, well, I say we, but I'm pretty sure it's him so that we can say we split the drive because I drove the entire way up. <laughs> you didn't drive at all. No, I offered. I, I know, it doesn't, it, but it doesn't make sense. I couldn't have slept anyway, so. Yeah, I know. Yeah, but I mean, this is this uh, full, full, full shop and I don't, what, what was back here? Oh, drain the tank. That's their air compressor. That's a big ass air compressor. Ooh. That is a big air compressor. All right, guys, that's the end of this video. Like I said, there's a whole nother video of actual shop time. And I think it's like 20, 20 some minutes. It's going to get shortened because there's some stuff that Mark and I were talking about that he said he definitely, he doesn't necessarily want out in the public yet. So I may save that footage uh, for a later date. Uh, but other than that, guys, that's the end of this video. I love you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, I'm going to put stuff in the corners. Um, let's see. I'm going to find a channel. that uh, There's a guy in Ohio that I'm going to link his channel in this corner. Uh, so he'll be down there at a video that YouTube thinks you like up here. A subscribe link. And then, like I said, if you want to support the channel so we can do stuff like this, this trip really didn't cost us anything really except for just gas because uh, there was some place for us to stay. But there's a join tab right here. Guys, I love you all. 
And for you guys, it might be a few days, but for me, I'll see you tomorrow.